What's up, everybody? Petty Manny back. And we're as John. And now that Arthur's gone, we gotta deliver these goods to some ranch. So. West past Owen Gila, then follow the road north. Okay. Definitely a long game, I'll say that for it. You get your money's worth out of this one. So There's a house out there. I don't know if that's it. This must be it. Mr. Geddes? No, sir. I'm Mr. Dickens, his overseer. Jim Milton. I'm delivering some supplies from the store in Strawberry. Okay. This is quite a place. Yes, it's beautiful. Oh. They send everything? Yeah, I think so. So, partner, your boss, he looking for hands? Why? You looking for work? Yeah. My wife, we was in business with her family and turned sour. It's a long story. Yeah, I don't know. Married hands. It's a lot of trouble. I'm a good worker. My wife, Agatha, even our boy, Lancelot. We'll all work. <laughs> Big man Lancelot. around, boy? Get the hell out of here. <laughs> now, that ain't very neighborly. And threatening us is neighborly. <laughs> hey. Mind if I enjoy one of these apples? Put that down. <laughs> Delicious. Oh. <laughs> When's uh, Boss Man gonna sell this place, boy? I don't think there's any plans for that. You boys want a drink? It's some fine scotch whiskey. Put that down. Put that down. Oh. These supplies for the season. Get off the farm. Come on. 
We know when we're not wanted. Get down from there! Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Bye, bud! <laughs> Come back here! You can use that horse. And don't get yourself hurt. Or hurt them, for that matter. <laughs> Ain't got no weapons or nothing. That's my damn wagon! Look at this hand here! You want your wagon back? Huh? Hey! Well? Hey! This is your last chance to come out of this breathing! Get on with you! No! Whoa, whoa! You can't take a joke, mister! Tell Gaddy's to take that off of off Mr. Abel, or we get a whole lot more funny. Turn the wagon to Pronghorn Ranch. Thank you. Milton, isn't it? Those boys are out of Laramie. Work for Mr. Abel. Thank you. Don't mention it. Listen, I ain't looking for no charity or nothing, but I was serious. You got work? We'll work. I can do anything. We got... We got robbed ourselves a few days back. We ain't got married hands here. You're married. I work harder than any one of them. I'm real honest, and my wife... Even though she's got fancy thoughts, she'll work. Seem kind of desperate. What trouble you in? No trouble, sir. Aside from her brother. He tricked us and robbed her of her inheritance. We're good people. We'll work. Even Lancelot. <laughs> what does Mr. Geddes need with a boy? Just another mouth to feed. Just please give us a chance. I can handle myself, okay? You know that already. Yeah. Makes me wonder just who would have robbed you. But we'll give you a chance. I'll let Mr. Geddes know when him and his wife return tomorrow. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. I'll go get my wife. Nah, no, you stay here. It's getting late. We'll go get her in Strawberry. We'll bring her here tomorrow. We need you around in case any more of them Laramie boys turns up. There's a, a little cabin out yonder past the ranch house. If things work out, y'all can stay there. Thank you. You'll not regret this. Yep. Go get yourself settled. We'll have work for you tomorrow when Mr. Geddes returns. Pronghorn Ranch, Epilogue Part 1. Another go, girl. Give me him. No, no. Get over here. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John Jim? 
Extra hard. <laughs> hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens, go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say, is that your family getting in the Boring, wagon brother. up there? Ah, believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we uh not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no, sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. I was going to milk the cows. Come on. I'll do it. You? Hey, are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know. Up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything. The ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand then. Just a ranch hand. <laughs> Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Here's the cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Yeah, but most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. You got the hang of it. Almost got a pail full. Well, this is fun and exciting, isn't it? your boy? Sure. Hey, Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make a dairy maid of your paw yet. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. That's we all enough, gotta yeah. earn our keep. Come on. How about you and the boy uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. you now, Lancelot? Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand. 
It's such a fine name. It's been a long time, like though. I got... I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> I can tell. Now, it ain't pleasant work, but it's gotta be done. Mr. Dickens said... I know what he said. We'll do it. Won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. Jack, let's just... try and take some pride in this work. Hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Picking up horse poop. Who would have thought that this would be a video game, right? You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Ew. Coming. <sighs> Stinking piles of. You almost got me. Sure, I did, boy. One more pile. Look at this horse shit. <laughs> Even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Okay. <laughs> this is some goofy outfit, I can tell you that much. Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, what do you know? Me too. Put some coffee on. <laughs> well, we're wearing a different outfit now. Oh boy. Fun, fun, fun. David Geeds or Tom Dickens? Some work to be done around ranch with Mr. Dickens. David Geeds may need to speak to you. Let's go do some work. Go away. Hey, Milton, can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Nope. Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? Robbing and stealing. I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. 
so I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. That should be pretty self-explanatory. Now, lift up the other side. You gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Good. And that's it. <laughs> He's like pulling it out when he puts it in there. <laughs> that's kind of stupid. Fine. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but... There's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. Learn how to swing that hammer, dude. Why are you doing it that okay. way? Gee, Merry Christmas. Don't they know how to swing a hammer? Come on, Rockstar. That's retarded. You don't swing a hammer. There, now he's swinging it the right way. Even a monkey knows how to swing a hammer. Down and get over here, boy. Quick as you can. Come on, son. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, of course not. The basics. Don't make him mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! What are you doing, you idiot? Shit! I'll get him! Keep on, Milton. Use my lasso to catch He knocked my fence down, you stupid bull. No, you don't! Yeah, what are you gonna do now? Don't tear no. uh, Don't! I gotta build that! Hello! Okay. You need a horse, dude. Like you're gonna wind down, <laughs> but I'll try. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. You're an angry one. Whoa there. Whoa there. Easy, easy. There, there. There, there. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of Chuck. You're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. <laughs> there just he my is. Head. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. the car. 
coffee on. Thank you. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. I'm cleaning at the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Get the place to tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. Got seventeen dollars, man. <laughs> Starting from scratch. How much time have I been? I don't even know what I've been recording for. Oh, phooey. Um. All right, I'm gonna split these up, I guess, and just do it that way. Um. If you guys liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one.